You better get that sign tape. So. I'm no good at responsibility, Martin. Never have been. All my bosses have always said I've got an untrustworthy face. So, uh, what do you make of this operation? Bit of a dog, eh? Huh? Most of the blokes here are a sausage short of the barbecue at the very least. I want people to know that I'm proud of my white history and my white blood. One day it might be all I have. I'll leave him with that bloody ostrich. <laughs> and the pretty material he got from your dad. You won't even notice she's gone. Aren't you gonna buy a mate to be? A beer. The celebration's tonight. My family's giving me a party. And besides, you know the rule about drinking at lunchtime. She came back to me, silver horse! <laughs> Three years of university, I sign up, spend two months bobbing across the Pacific on a rust bucket, through the Panama Canal, being bounced up the Atlantic, <laughs> boofed down the St. Lawrence, banged on a train, get here, meet you, find out you've got a soft spot for poetry, and only bloody well know one. Oh, the agonising pain of it all. That's what she said. I often wonder what she meant, but I suppose I knew straight away. I just wanted someone to talk to. Shut up. Can you be quiet just for a few miles? I think I'm gonna like it here. Acapulco. Acapulco is at the end of a very long... Very lonely road. Why are you doing this? The night Al made you. You want to tear all that down? I don't need a gun, man. Take the gun. Hey, I'm just a show. Hey, you want to go out? I don't know. Uh, we go to a restaurant. Uh, go to a movie. Eat something. I don't know. Go out. Out, out, you know, out. My boy Mike once asked Bailey how he got to be so fat. He said it was because every time he met somebody he liked, his heart would grow a little. At least within Brown and Williamson's representation clearly misstated what is common language within the company. We are in the nicotine delivery business. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here? Give me a name of a company that doesn't have often old business that you would trust. Trust with your own family. I've uh, read your preprints. Both of them. One on uh, Nazi ciphers and the other one on uh, nonlinear equations. And I am supremely confident that there is not a single seminal or innovative idea in either one of them. What is it with this man? I kill a relative of his in battle, perhaps? His boy, God forbid. Right, lab rats, just remember, we're not here for the dental plan. They are die, Byron. I'm getting sprung from hell. Now you can live life rich in jail for the rest of your born days. Or be poor outside for some of them. That's what I can promise you. Now you know I gotta get really drunk so I need to sleep on the plane. I'll take the kids to the Lion King. Again. I never have kids. When you walk out of here, no, I will be waiting for you. You gotta go on the record. Swing spotlight back on there. You gotta protect yourself, man. I don't care what you say, or how you say it. I don't believe he did it. My name is Mr. Knight!
You may call me Jack. Can this be true? I don't believe what I see. A man your age, to be as strong as you are. When you step out of your house in the morning with your children, you take them to the parks at the five boroughs, do you feel safe? Yes, you do feel safe, because I get your letters, and I know you do. That's us, working together, getting it fixed. Tell me things haven't changed. Yeah. That's right, man! Your mother and I foresaw the coming calamity, and we took certain steps to ensure your survival. Do you spend time wondering about the world? The workings of things? No, sir. Right, well, better not to start now. It's going to destroy the world. A great flood is coming. We build a vessel to survive the storm. 